World War Z promises to be one of the big summer blockbuster smashes, and we are talking to one of the stars of the film, Mire Enos. Good morning, and welcome to Studio 10. Good morning. Thank you. Now, after shooting this movie, World War Z, all about zombies, do you live in fear of answer. zombies? <laughs> no, I think if anything, this movie cured me of my fear of zombies. Oh, it cured you of your fear of yes. zombies. You're not a zombie. You're, so. you're not a zombie yourself now, though, are you? I am not. She is not a zombie. She is here on <laughs> Studio 10, and we are talking about this great film. You play Brad Pitt's wife in this movie, and something you had talked about and that I've heard is that it has a real family element to it. It has all those big blockbuster, box office, cool special effects type things, but it's also a great story as well. Can you talk about that? Sure. That's the thing that drew me the, to the script when I read it, was that at the center of all of this kind of swirling action is this uh, very simple family survival story. Four people who just adore each other and are willing to do anything it takes to stay alive. Now, behind the scenes, when you're running and in fear of the zombies, are you running away from humans? Are you just told to yeah. run and you're on a green screen? Like, how did it work filming this? No, we did hardly hardly any green screen at all. They had um, troops of movement artists and uh, stuntmen come in, and so we were actually being chased by these big, strong, scary dudes. <laughs> it, it, it was very motivating. <laughs> Always scary to be chased by big, strong, scary dudes. That is definitely yeah. true. Now, you yourself, I looked at your acting resume, and I've seen you in plenty of things before. You have done so many different things, from movies mm -hmm. to television, but this may be the biggest blockbuster type movie you've done. Do you agree with that? And how do you feel about that? Absolutely. This is definitely my biggest blockbuster, and um, and it was a hoot, you know. And the thing that was really nice was that no matter how big or small the project is, it still just felt like going to work with wonderful people and trying to tell the best story we could tell. And uh, it's really exciting to see it come out in the world. Now, I know you're married to Alan Ruck, Cameron yes. from Ferris Bueller's Day Off, and I know Brad Pitt is with Angelina Jolie, but mm -hmm. did you still get some of your single friends asking you, what's Brad like? Is he hot? that kind of yes. stuff everybody asks that <laughs> <laughs> and what do you say oh he's great he's just wonderful so good to work with Brad Pitt and also the director Mark Forster has a lot of people don't know a lot about him but he's done a lot of huge films like Quantum of Solace which was also a big action movie but also on the other side Finding Neverland which really right. is a more artsy piece do you feel like he kind of fuses those two with this film yeah, Mark is remarkable in that way, that every piece he does is is set in a very different world. And I think what he brought to this was that quality of keeping the story simple and small amidst this huge plot line. All right, so do the zombies win or do the humans win? I'm not telling. Oh, not telling. you got to go see the movie <laughs> World War Z. Thank you so much for talking to us this morning Thank on you, Studio Joe. 10. Have a great Thank day. You. Bye. You too.